morning, morning. <laughs> and welcome to weekend vlog number nine. <laughs> oh, you yes, because I looked it up quickly <laughs> what uh, the last one was. All right. I thought it might have been number 10, but I guess that's because we didn't do it last week. No. Um, but last week we had a bit of a break because we, well, I wasn't really feeling the want to vlog. But this weekend I do, and we've got some fun-ish type things planned. I mean, we're not going out anywhere because... I mean, we need payday. Exactly. Yeah, we're pretty much broke. So, <laughs> um, long month. Next weekend's going to be a good one, and then hopefully, following weekend after that, we'll be doing something going out, and then the weekend after that, we'll be going out somewhere. So, um, stay tuned for those. Um, but right now it is quarter to eleven, and we're just going to head out to the shops to pick up some groceries and then we're going to come home and tidy up our very very messy house yeah it's grim yeah so <laughs> anyway we shall see you later <laughs> bye. bye look how big our tesco is it's a superstore that's what it's classed as extra tesco extra i thought it was a superstore it says tesco extra on the, on the top oh. let me go away hello Open 24 hours. Yeah, it is. It's very muggy. This morning. Coin the bread there as well. Where is it? It's a Power Ranger movie morpher. So you've got the coins up here. Yeah. This way. Yeah, we're still going. Stop talking. <laughs> Easily amused. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> it's a messy one. Oh. Sounds a bit like you. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> this is cool. Cocoa Pops porridge. And they've also got crunchy nut porridge as well. And what are you looking at? Blue green banana. Banana and strawberry. Would you want to try the cocoa pops? Apple and cherry. Try this. It's probably really, really bad for you still. Probably. Let's see. It's got 5.4 grams of sugar. Yeah, that's a fair bit. I think we should try it. One and a half minutes. Seven packets. If India's watching this, India's going to be like, no, don't do it. Get the normal one and make it yourself. <laughs> but it's Cocoa Pops. <laughs> I know, my face lit up a little when I saw it. Crunchy, I know. Right? How much did you get in a pack? But also, also, Seven. also, David's found these. Here, take that. I got my list with that as well. These oat and fruit breakfasts to go. You literally just, you just sup this down you, basically. Oh. Sup, sup, S-U-P. You don't do anything with it. I think that is oh. gross. <laughs> Sorry. Look at that. Look, look, look. Pop tarts. Oh, Cheerios and shreddies. It's just like a mini pack, isn't it? Really? Oh, yeah, like for on the go. I got a bit too excited for what it actually was this. <laughs> <laughs> I like the flavour, strawberry, raspberry and cranberry. Yeah, Apple they got a cherry. lot. Gosh, that's got... Okay, so that is 5.4 grams of sugar. That one's got 16.2 grams of sugar. Holy crap. So those are more sugary. This is our world food out with the world... Well, US foods. So Lucky Charms. Pancake mix and Pop-Tarts. And I really want to get... Where are they? These ones. The s'mores ones. Like £3.50. David has... Pancake mix. We don't want gluten free. What have you found? Liquid, Liquid smoke. smoke. What does. It's a natural hickory recipe. You just brush it on steaks, burgers, chicken, etc. Blah, blah, blah. Give it, a, give it a smoke flavour without any of the bad stuff, allegedly. And I've got Ooh. salsa con queso. Whatever that is. Peanut butter. Have you found grape jelly. grape jelly? Peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. <laughs> Toasted. And then that. you've got all the. Got peanut butter Oreos up here. There's six. Oh, look, we've got these now. Yeah, they've had them for ages. Oh. Yeah. Shut up. Got, is that. Oh. <laughs> yeah, those are so good. I mean, is that Gatorade? Yeah. yeah. Fruit punch. 
Snapple. And then Snapple. That's my favorite, that one. Pop Rocks. Wait, no, not that one, the one next to it. The strawberry and kiwi. Pop Rocks, remember them? Mm. Well, I say remember them, though. Right. Right, go on then. Yep. yep. <laughs> it's so much easier shopping this way just to scan and go and then you pack your bag up done so it's all done so finish and pay and just like that all good let's go let's go ooh, ooh, ooh. Trolley cam, look, trolley cam. <laughs> la, 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 la. This is yummy. What's my bacon and potatoes with cheese? Look at that. I think not, it's not bad for a little ready meal thing. I've had this before on a few times. Yeah, you have. Superman pajamas. <laughs> yeah, baby. What's oh, Steph got? I have. Prawns in spaghetti and chive. It's got some cheesy sauce, I think. Yeah. Do you know what to watch? We're doing vlogs or TV? Vlogs. So many to choose from. I know. <laughs> well, see, so we could carry on with like a Clary tale. If you want. Yeah. But her next one's like 34 minutes. So. Okay, fine. We'll I'm, not, I'm not cleaning until I've eaten my food cell. <laughs> Okay, well let's watch a Clary tale then. Shout out. <laughs> Go for it. Come on then. Advert! Ah! What are we up to? We're baking, baking, baking. Excited? Yeah. What are we baking? Uh. Cinnamon loaf of icing drizzle. Is that what it is? Yeah, or it's called. Um, Cinnamon drizzle cake. Now we made this before, years ago. Not with this recipe though. Fine, but look at the size of that. Well you can't see on, on the picture, on the camera, right? We did it in a, in a tray, it was about this big in the tray, right? We're it trying puffed. to figure out what we actually yeah, it baked it in. ended up being like probably this big when it puffed out all over it. We, we, we gave like a quarter of it away to our friends and we had enough for like days. It was so yeah, moist. Yeah, but that really. one was a cherry loaf that I made. Because I put maraschino. Ooh. Yahoo! Hoop de doo! <laughs> Sorry. Got a bit distracted there. But yes, we are making and we are baking. I mean, it's a bit late. Well, it's not late, it's 4.59, almost 5 o'clock. Hundred and fifty grams of cup of sugar. Butter. Ah. Ah. This is super soft. So my granny used to always have butter in a sort of metal tin, like already soft and covered. And then you'd have marmite or jam or something. It's actually still a bit hard in the middle, it's just the outside. Yeah, but once you've done that, it'd be fine. All soft. Yeah. Makes change. Huh? <laughs> this is what creamed butter. Quite like. apt, isn't it? This one. Yeah. One by one. One more thing you love to sleep while you digest. Ah. Oh, David is contributing. He's just put two teaspoons of baking powder in there. Good and now. No, I'll just clean this kitchen. I'm not in cinnamon and spill anywhere. No, it ain't happening. Not on my watch. No, 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 no. Oh dear. Something quite atrocious. If you say it loud enough, you're always so precocious. Super califragilistic. Yeah, 
Bradgett Kelly Rufus. <laughs> that one? Yeah. Is that not enough? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And now my girl's my wife. Oh, and a lovely thing she yeah. Right, I'm probably not doing this right, but. We can shake it after and it will separate. It's going to rise like happen. crazy. Look at that. Oops. <laughs> oh yeah, a little boogie on. <laughs> We're nearly ready. It hasn't risen that much, has it? It's risen a little bit, but it's not as much as the foils. Um, I keep forgetting I have to lift the screen bar and do this. Oh, <laughs> oh it looks good. There it is. One minute, One minute 45. and 46. Almost there. It yeah. smells good though. Mm. And then we let it cool, and then we make See? the icing, and then we just go. Choo, 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 choo. Are you set on eating it? Right now. No, in general, you. I would like to try some of what I made, yes. Because now I come down in the evening, I play a game, watch yes, TV. This is mostly for you, but I would yeah! like to have some. If no! That's right. No! Seriously, I made the goddamn thing <laughs> and yet I don't get to have any. <laughs> this is for poking. <laughs> oh, yeah, there's a move. In my Jimmy Jam. Would How you like this? to poke it? Sorry? Would you like to poke it? Oh, so. In the middle, because you know. Yeah, all the way down until yes. you hit the bottom. And there Nothing, is no baby. goo on that. That is ready. One more. Mm, what should I get? No. Yeah, that's good. All good, baby. It's ready. Get in my belly. Right, so we want to leave that for a few minutes and then we'll transfer it to a cooling rack. Like a cooling rack, eh? It smells really good. It's kind of like, I was saying to David, the way that this looks reminds me of when we used to get the, um, when we used to get the cinnamon sugar pretzels um, in Westfield, London. There's, a, I think it's Mr. Pretzel or something it's called, but we used to get it every time we went to the cinema. That was like my snack. So oh, God, I remember that. Yeah. And then we got the ones with Nutella on as well, remember? Oh, it was amazing. It was like, oh, man, it was good. They were so good. So I would get cinnamon, you'd get Nutella, and we'd have my peppermint hot chocolate from yeah. Starbucks. It was like a dusted cinnamon and sugar. Yeah, and because they would give out free samples as well when you were walking around and that's how we loved it because we ate one and we were like, oh my God, we need one right now. Yeah, I'm us, doesn't it look like a sponge you clean your car with? No! <laughs> smells immense though, doesn't it? Can I see, I, I greased it in, but you know, fitness people amongst you will not approve of the butter you used, but it came out, didn't it? In one piece. Oh, it's gonna be so soft. Yep. Oh, get in my belly. We haven't got any ice cream. Damn it! What? Can I have ice cream with it? Oh, I ain't going back out. I'm a hot, sweaty. I'm a hot, sweaty mess. You go. I always go to the shop. I have my cake with tea or coffee. Oh yeah, we're playing. I'm playing this again because I like it. So. <laughs> you haven't gone back in time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Right. right. Don't know if you can hear me or not. There we go. This is our steak from Muscle Food. Which sirloin. Like sirloin, yeah. I've lightly seasoned it because Steph isn't massively fond of loads of seasoning. So that'll be going in here once it's nice and hot. She's getting there. We're getting there indeed. 
and we're pricing up Disney holidays. <laughs> <laughs> Well, we're trying to work out kind of your passes and if it's worth it and stuff and there's not much it's actually more and obviously you've got to do plus tax but it's, yeah. it's more than if you but, bought combined but the thing is if you buy it in a pass then you don't need to do a package therefore you can get a discount on the hotel room potentially you get discount on merchandise etc etc so on and so forth so dinner is served there is the steak um, I'm having mine with vegetables and we got some halloumi which we've probably fried grilled to an inch of its life um, we had that leftover from last weekend and it smells really good and I'm so hungry and David has chips steak now, and halloumi the steak looks like it's well done and burnt I'm guaranteeing there's not well, we shall it was see seared because the pattern went <coughs> near rough yeah it did because somebody to put too much oil in the pan had it on a high heat and then put the steak on with the pan on the high heat, yeah. put the steak in. Whereas no. he didn't reduce the heat or take the pan off the heat to put it in. Because so it went a bit crazy, didn't it? The sandwiches. Hmm. Anyway. I'm cut into this. Storbing. Yeah, let's see what yours looks like. Looks <laughs> a bit tough. It's the fat. So it's, oh, you got it. Oh, it's slightly pink in the middle. Yeah. Cool. Nice. It's a medium. Maybe on the cusp of medium well, but Yeah, no, probably. I don't know, actually it's sort of We'll eat it and see. No, it's got a pink bit in the middle. That is absolutely fine. That's medium. That's beautiful. So the outside is seared nicely. Right, so we're go, shall we? <laughs> That's good. Right, well, I'm gonna eat mine now. Enjoy. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. We finished dinner. It was good. 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 And we have to thank Dave in India for helping us out with the muscle order, muscle food thing, and, uh, for suggesting it. Yeah, it's been really good. I mean, mm. we've still got about 12 meals left. Mm. Um, Meatballs, burgers, hash steaks, mini chicken fillets, and, and two porks, pork. well, four porks, two sets of chicken breasts. So, <coughs> so yeah, we've done that and now we're going to, well, Steph's going to make the cinnamon icing for the cake and then we're going to have some of this for dessert, or well, at least I am. Steph could have a Solero, she wants a Solero. <laughs> oh. So the icing is brown <laughs> because I put cinnamon in it. It's like when you have that leftover stuff from Weetabix. Um, so, we'll just drizzle it on. Oh, mama. Because it's got the fridges, it's not, it's not going to spill everywhere either. It sets. Yeah, baby. Put this in yeah, here. put the cover back on it. These are really good. Is that too hot though? What? The hob? Nah, nah, it would have cooled down by now. Don't trust it. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to put the cinnamon in there. Yeah. 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 I can't get to my cake. No! Wait, 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 I'm going to lift this screen up. So, what? time now is quarter past eight and we don't know what to do for the rest of the, of the evening. We've just watched um, Spoonful of Sugar's latest uh, Disney World vlog. Yeah. It's the day. This food. You hungry? You want this now? In your bowl? In the bowl? You sure? Okay. You hungry? You hungry? Yeah? Okay. I don't I'm... want the edge, so you... Okay, I'm going to have a bit about that big. Yeah, go on then. About that big. Oh, look at that. Look at the inside. Looking very nice and moist. 
So it's a cake loaf, it's not a bread loaf. But How much? hold on, hold on, hold on. No, let go. That's minuscule. That'll do for me. You're gonna regret it. Me too. Why, why, why are you let me cut it? Okay. Right. So you wanna put this on? Or the flares don't get it in the chaos. Right, try some of yours. You need first reaction. Do you want a fork or anything? <laughs> no. I'm so stupid. <laughs> Is it good? Good prep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, we'll let him enjoy that. You don't really want to see him eat that. Right. Okay, so I'm going to try a little bit as well and give you my reaction. Have a little. Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. I'm going to need some in the middle bit because that's a bit crunchy. Mm. It's nice, it's nice and, and soft, yeah. Mm. And it's not. Overpowered by cinnamon, like it's not like. It tastes so good with tea. Yeah, I'll do it in the morning, yeah. Mm. Too bad that'll be gone by the morning. I may save you a slice. Mm. Well, if you make me pancakes. Oh, you bang on about you, bloody you pancakes. <laughs> I don't get breakfast made for me. I don't even get a cup of tea made for me anymore. Can you believe that? He gets no tea made for him because. <laughs> because. Sorry. He gets no tea made for him. Because he doesn't wake up early enough. He gets up so late. Okay, I'm up, right? It used to be half five, no, 20 past five, and now it's... Okay. Ah, now I get up at quarter six. I think I'm entitled to a bit of a lay in the yeah, weekend. Yeah, you do have a lay in. What time did you wake up this morning? Well, you first Ten came... o'clock. Well, no, you came in to wake me up. Because I slept in the spare room because it was too hot for me. So, you woke me up once and I was like, no, I'm sleeping. And you left and came back. What time was the first time you woke me up? Eight. Endless. Endless. Eight o'clock. Because we had things to do. No, we didn't. We had things to potter around with. Anyway, I used to make you tea. Mm. Yes, I did. Mm -hmm. I used to make you tea. And I don't make pancakes because you make the best pancakes in the world. I make crap so... pancakes. You're such a liar. <laughs> I'm not a liar. You make really, really good pancakes. I call BS on that one, but... Anyway, anyway okay. I want to eat my cake. Bye. Oh, me, me. So we have decided that, well, I've come upstairs and basically changed and got ready for bed. Um, I don't really feel like watching anything because I'm tired and feel a little bit achy for some reason. Don't know why. Um, so I've come upstairs and I am going to read my book. My Game of Thrones. This is book four, A Feast for Crows. Uh, David is downstairs. He's probably going to play his PlayStation or something. But um, I'm going to read for a little bit and then probably go to bed. So I'm going to say goodnight for now. Um, David says goodnight too. <laughs> and I'll see you in the morning. Night night. Look how cute she is. The little fish. She is a sparkle. Something woke her up and uh So cute. Good morning and happy Sunday, everybody. I am just downstairs at the moment. David's still asleep. 
Um, it's currently 8.30. Um, made myself a tea and ow, ow. And um, I was just about to sit down and put some TV on when this one decided that she wanted to lie with mummy. Say hello. Say mummy. I am needing endlessly and I will not settle. Come on, baby. Come on. Come on. <laughs> yes, so I'm going to watch the TV, wait for David to get up and I'm hoping he's still going to make me some um, pancakes. <laughs> Still not slightly awake yet, but there you go. <laughs> yes, so, um, but today probably going to be staying in because it's not very nice out there at the moment. It's quite grey, um, but there's things that we want to do, so stay tuned for those and I'll catch you later. <gasps> she has landed. morning. I've not been up that long and Steph wants pancakes. So I thought I'd just show you how I do them. It's not really interesting but it's very very simple. Basically all you do is is literally one cup of flour, self-raising, one cup of milk, so the measurements are the same, one egg, beat, shove in a pan, a few minutes, done job. So we'll see how they uh, how they come out. Well, I'll show you as I'm actually doing it. So a cup of flour, a cup of milk, one egg as you can see. This is the only whisk I have in the house and it's absolute crap. And we keep meaning to buy one, but every time I see it, I, I don't get it because I'm obviously stupid. So basically just gonna whisk all that together and yeah, we should be good to go. And there you go, one pancake in the pan. Obviously we all have to make pancakes, but these are Jamie Oliver's um, American pancake recipe where she just puts the one cup of milk and flour and one egg, a pinch of salt, and um, yeah, Steph likes these, and they're pretty good. Um, when I don't balls them up, they're, uh, they're pretty nice. We did make them for when uh, some friends of ours stayed recently, and I was kind of panicking trying to make for three people, so it took me a me a bloody long time to, to actually do it, which is uh, annoying because I get really flustered in the kitchen on my own. <laughs> um, I don't mind cooking, but I wish I was a little bit better at it and a bit more patient with, uh, with, with sort of certain things. So uh, yeah, let's cook her three or four of these and then I can go and have my cup of tea and relax because I've not done anything since I've woken up, apart from do this. So yeah, see you later. There's the final product. Dripping in golden syrup, just the way Steph likes it. Because she doesn't like the maple stuff, she's got a stack of four there. Um, hopefully she will enjoy them. Hmm. I have pancakes, I'm so excited. Thank you, David. You're welcome. Yee, look, 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 look at them, look at them, look at them. Aren't they just the yummiest looking things ever? Yum. <laughs> right, I'm going to eat them now. So we are back from the shops. It's very windy out there and very strange. It's sunny and then cloudy and then rain and then sunny and then cloudy and then rain. <laughs> and poor David, he is suffering at the moment. He's got really bad hay fever. Um, yeah, it's him. Doesn't, he's not happy. Not a happy bunny. I don't like this. The tablet's not working. Yeah, well, he did say that you haven't been taking it for the past couple of days. Yesterday so. and today. Mm -mm. Well, I thought I'd show you what we got. Not a lot, but... Oops, that's something. Um, yeah, if you want. <laughs> Excuse my sniffing, I do apologise. <laughs> so, David saw this. We went to Tiger. So, David saw this, and um, I thought it was really cute. It's like a sort of suitcase type carrier, and it's a consultina, so... Um, this is, let's see. So we saw it and thought this is the kind of thing you can keep all your holiday planning things in. Ah, a little consultina. So that will be handy to put any printouts that I have or whatnot research for holidays 
or next year possibly. Hopefully. Yay! Woo! <laughs> Please. And then we saw this. Oh, and yeah. I was like, I love this so much. It is basket. Like, you know when you go to these old school diners and stuff? And then we've got four of these and two, uh, well, one of each of these. Um, and actually, I wonder if it's got, although it does say four piece set. I wonder if it's got the paper in it. Hopefully. To get you that started. That's cool. Ah, yeah, the paper underneath. Mm. It says paper to go in each. That's you know, cool. You know what it means, don't you? By, by using them for like burgers and chips and things like that. No washing up, apart from the, you need to the pots. Yeah, the plastic stuff. Not got um, paper on it. But so that was five pounds from Tiger, and this was four pound from Tiger. Oh, oh, oh! Some glasses. Um, oh, <laughs> we saw this as well. <laughs> well we going the, the, the American spoon, bean. Well, yeah, American, or if you're in a greasy spoon cafe, it was only a pound in Tiger though. Well, I'd be careful when you're like touching it because it's actually quite sharp here. Yeah. Yeah, but um. But when people stay, you can just put that on the table. Yeah. Go. Mess That's about too much. Pound. Got some apples. Got a sharpener. Ooh. And David found these tutti frutti grapes, and I want to try them. Yeah. You try them? Yeah. Because what's it's meant? To, it says it's different flavors, isn't it? It says it's like melon and. Yeah. With a burst of fruity flavour, from mango to strawberry, these super fruity grapes are naturally grown for their distinctive flavour. And they're from Brazil. Right. I think I still got toothpaste because it tastes like when you have orange juice after you've brushed your teeth. So I think I'm still a bit too pasty. Tastes like grape. No. I have to try it like... Oh! I mean, you can get the... Yeah, it does have a kind of fruity after kick. And then... Saw this in... Smith's. So, just nicked one of these. Apparently you can win a holiday to experience the wisdom world of Harry Potter. Exciting times to be alive. Closing date is the 3rd of September 2016. Brilliant. <laughs> There's a bookmark, isn't it? But yeah, that's all we got. I think fantastic. We probably shouldn't have gotten that or that or that or that. <laughs> but we needed a sharpener and yeah. I want fruit for my snacks during the week. Oh crap. That's what I wanted to look for in Poundland. Popcorn. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because that's my crisp snack. Not as bad as kettle chips, but mm. oh, I'll have to go tomorrow on the way to work. Yeah. So, I don't know what we're doing now. Um, Excuse we... the messy house. <laughs> Mini Min. Oh. I think she's very, very vocal today. So vocal. Oh, yeah. What are you doing? She's in okay, I'm going to play in your box. Hello. So not much has happened since we last spoke. We d well, I did not do anything. I ended up having a nap. Um, and David, I think he played on his game for a little bit and watched TV whilst I was sleeping. Um, and now it is, what time is it? 10 past five? Uh, yeah. Coxworth is saying 10 past five? Yeah. So now what we're going to do is some more baking fun yeah and this time we're gonna make some cookies that have a nice bit of fun in the middle so I've made these types of cookies before I made Nutella ones um, and they were really fun to make and they turned out really well so I'm quite excited to make some cherry ver versions of them black cherry one thing we haven't said yet is about um, Damien. Oh, yes. So today is uh, Sunday the 26th. No, 25th. Tomorrow's 26th. Yes, yeah, so it's 25th of June. And our good friend Damien from Domindia, uh, he is doing a... Uh, he's playing golf. Four, 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 four 18-hole rounds of golf 
for Macmillan Cancer. Uh, cancer. Um, and he, he basically started at 8 o'clock this morning and yeah. I don't think he's finishing till, what did he say, Probably 8, about 9 o'clock? 9 o'clock, so he'll still be going out. I know he's done over halfway already. That was a few well, hours yeah, ago. I mean, if he finishes at 8, he's got another three hours to yeah. go. So um, um, we, will, we will put the link to thing on there. Yes, Anybody wants to, um, really good cause and we're you know, very, very... And very fair proud play on him. of him. Yeah, he's done really yeah. well to um, to get to the level that he's at now with, with, with getting the money together and stuff. But yes. I think, you know, even, even if it's like just a pound here and there from people, it all adds up. Um, yeah, and the Macmillan Cancer um, Research Charity, it's a really good, it's a really good cause. Yeah. So, <laughs> there was a slight mishap with the recipe, I think, where they came out like cake mix, wasn't it? Yeah, I mean, you can see it's very, very gooey, mm. um, and that's not what I want, but we added more flour. Yeah, mixed it again. And, and um, it's still gooey, but not as gooey as before, and mm. I can do what I need to do yeah. with it. Yeah, may not be a bad thing. We'll, we'll put one, one set through, see how they come out, and then if they're not quite according to plan, put more flour in the rest of the mix, and then yeah. go again. Right, so we'll just cook like now. Hmm. I'll eat them either way, it doesn't really bother me, but Steph is a bit of a perfectionist when it comes to baking. It's, she's like me with cooking, like I said earlier about pancakes. If I, uh, if I don't get it right first time, I get really peed off. Don't I? Mm -hmm. Right, so, what I do is, I just put some flour in there. All experimentation, there's no right or wrong. You just do. As I said, you can always put a little um, another layer of chocolate on, or mix on top of it. Now what I want to do is so basically put this in the middle. Oh, oh no, 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 no. Stay. Yeah, so put this in the middle. And then, why not? I covered in chocolate. Oh, missed one out. Right. Then, it's going to be interesting. It. Yeah, it was hard to do it with the Nutella, but this is going to be hard because huh? it's going to goop out. That's why I say if you bung a little thing on top of it. Well, no, because what I did before was this and <laughs> bang. <laughs> Basically. Oh, Jesus. Oh, I see, okay. You sort of fold it in kinda of like um So when it yeah like a, a, a bun. So when, when it when it cooks it's gonna have like little kind of lines down here like like, like crusty bread. I, like when crusty bread comes out it has that sort of well, line down you, it. You you had the Nutella one, so Yeah I've I've slept since then so I don't really remember. <laughs> This is not this is not a clean mix. <laughs> it's a very messy mix. But we make do. It'll be alright. It's fun. I'm looking it's forward, all to, good looking forward fun. to trying them anyway. Fun. And they look pretty good. I mean some of them are seeping out. <laughs> I think maybe I need to sort of do it a bit larger. But look, they look so good. I love how they look. Like the little cracks and stuff. Oh, They're yeah. so cute. And they smell, they smell. The more jam oozing out, the better, baby. That was a bit Hannibal Lecter there. <laughs> right, right, so let these cool for a few seconds nice. and then we'll transfer them to the cooling rack. Would you like to try a cookie? Yes, I want to try a cookie. Go on then. Go get one. I'll try one of the first ones that was cooked. Oh, lighting is not good over this side. But he doesn't care because he just wants the cookie. Right. See you inside? I think all the Did jam, you eat all the jam? I think all the jam is on this spot. So you ate all the jam then? <laughs> is it good? Uh, no. Okay. There's jam underneath. D describe the taste. Mm. Mm. It's, it's dark. Mm. It's like. Mm. And then there's some. Mm. Wow, 
descriptive. <laughs> okay. It's like soft, gooey chocolate cookie. And then there's like cherry jam. It just tastes like a cherry and chocolate mixed together. It's like the perfect combination. It is. I want more. Oh, God. And just so you know, that's how much cake is left from yesterday. I'm saving Steph that bit. Yeah, I said that he can have it, so. That's good. So what are we going to do now? We need to think about dinner. And then um, we're going to watch a film. What film are we going to watch? To find out, aren't you? I've already picked it out and put it on the side. Really? Mm hmm. Ooh, okay. Because I am that damn good. Okay, well, I'm going to go and look then. There you go. Cheeky sod, just ate another one. The small is the fact this big. And yeah, he says to me it's very, very small. Honestly, no. Well, no, that's, that sounds dirty. Let's to rewind that. The cookie was like this big, right? No, it was not. The rest of they like were that. They're all roughly the same size. That, that to that, right? No, that's that a is a pack of lies. It's not a pack of lies. Listen, Pinocchio, why don't Look, you turn to the smack me on Why the don't we hand. turn to the side and see your nose growing even longer from your lies? Oh, and yeah, you get a smack. Naughty boys get smacks. Child, man. You are a child. Look, you I'll ate a cookie you know what? You know what, right? before dinner. I'll go eat every single one of them right now. Really? And how will you feel? Mm -hmm. How will I feel? Mm -hmm. Well, I can't really say because it's a family channel, <laughs> not to mention this will channel? be used as evidence in my trial for murder. Mm -hmm, exactly, so there's nothing you can do about it. Oh... <laughs> Stop it! Ah. <laughs> Go away! Go away, you tiny! No. Ah. I'll end you. End me then. I'll end your ass. Come on then. I don't flinch like you. I don't mind flinch, being flinch, on camera. Flinch! Like. Flinch! 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 I'm gonna flinch. swear in a minute. Go away! <laughs> don't make me swear. Stop it! So all we have decided. No, it's fine. So we've decided on what we want to do. <laughs> or what we're doing. Um, just put dinner in the oven. That poor little oven's been going for quite a while now. Mm. It's got another 50 minutes to go. <laughs> um, but we're going to watch Cars. Whoops. Just felt like a bit of Carsage. <laughs> So we have finished watching Cars and um, Dave was saying how, what were you saying? Well how it's not ranked very highly amongst the Pixar films but I mean I think on on repeated viewing it's actually really really good. Okay. You know it's, it's, and there this are, is cool. There are extra reasons as to why I like it so much at the moment. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, I am, um, actually you know what I must admit though I think when I first saw it, I was like, meh, but I'm like you, got a newfound appreciation mm. after watching it again. It is very cool. Mm. I mean, you know, it's just a society of cars, isn't it? Yeah, but it's just, you know, just a, a cool world kind of, of you know, little, little town that's gone, because it happens, you know, and yeah, it's, it's just cool, you know. Yeah. The characters are fun, the racing's quite fun, and it's got a nice story, and yeah, you know, especially the ending, you know, it's nice yeah. to see that kind of thing happen, and then... Yeah. So we'll probably watch the second one before the third movie comes out in, I think, three weeks? So, I mean, so. Yeah, I mean, the, the second one is, from memory, a bit cack. It went a bit silly, yeah. but again, I think I've only seen it once, <clears> so <throat> we'll see how it goes. Mm. I do like that it's set all around the world, though, so you see, like, Japan, like mm. Tokyo and stuff like that. Um, so, yeah, that's pretty much it for this weekend's vlog. It's another weekend down. But we're that closer to Paris. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yep. So thank you all very much for watching. Um, as always, hope it wasn't too boring for you. Um, and stay tuned for next weekend's because hopefully that will be a lot of fun. Um, and if you haven't subscribed already, please do subscribe to us. Um, give us a like and comment below if you have any comments. <laughs> But until next week, bye. bye.